Uh, can you remember the first time you ever noticed the phenomenon Harry Potter when people started to talk about it and people started to read the book? I was really young, I think, when they first when they when they first came out. Um, but I, my dad read me the first book. Uh, it's like a kind of like bedtime story type thing. Um, so I was already a pretty big fan of the books before I even auditioned for the role. So yeah. But what did you think about the book when uh, your dad read it for you when you were a I think I thought this is addictive. I just like wanted him to keep reading. At the end of every chapter, I'd like beg him to keep to keep reading. They're such they're just such page turners. Um, I just thought she had such an amazing imagination. So did you used to talk to about the book in school or was it a big thing to talk about when you st before you started filming? Yeah, it was. Um, it was. I like I couldn't I was told that I wasn't allowed to tell my friends that I had the role and I had to kind of like keep it quiet and that was basically impossible for me because I was desperate to tell everyone I knew. Um, but yeah. So no, it was something I I wanted to talk about a lot before I started. Definitely. Yeah, and you have been uh, been filming now for <laughs> ten years. <laughs> um, yes, I have been filming now for ten years. It feels longer than that. I think it's even maybe eleven now. Um, I'm so sorry. It's okay. <laughs> Can I stop for just two seconds? <laughs> Get together. Okay. 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 <laughs> Sorry, okay, wait. <sighs> Say when you're ready. <laughs> okay, I've got you. <laughs> okay. Someone just said something to me and I just can't get it together. Okay, just just try, just go. <laughs> I'm sure I'll just like get into it. Yeah. Uh, so so would you say that? Oh my god. So, okay. So would you say that uh, that you and uh, Daniel and Rupert are you friends uh, even uh, when you're not filming? Um. Yeah. We. I mean, when we were making the films, we spent so much time together that um, we usually just spoke on the phone or whatever, because we needed to be spending time with our other friends and family. It would have been really intense to have been working with them every day and then seeing them at the weekends as well. But um, yeah, no, I mean, we definitely keep in touch, definitely. So will you keep uh, meeting them as friends? <laughs> or? <laughs> okay, so keep going. Will I keep meeting them as friends? Yeah. Yes, definitely. They. Um, Sorry, do you want to ask the question again? Because I'm going to ruin. So, you. We, so will you keep meeting them as friends even when you now when you stopped filming? Yeah, definitely. Weirdly, I think I'll probably spend more time with them outside of work. Um, I, to be honest, I really didn't spend any time with them outside of the film set. So it'll be interesting to like. It's quite a weird idea for me to go and like hang out at Rupert's house or go and see Dan in a restaurant or something because we're always just working together. But uh, it'll be fun. I'm excited for our friendship to develop post Potter. So what would you say is your favorite spell from the movie? Um, my favorite spell? Uh, there's like a spell that I'm fond of, which is Wingardium Leviosa, just because it was like the first thing I said in, in that first film. But um, I know there are some pretty cool ones. I quite like to do a stunning jinx. You know, like if, if anyone recognized me, I could just go, just do that spell and then just be like frozen for a while while I could kind of like <laughs> get away. That would be good. Um, what else? I don't know. Two. That's, that's got to be good enough, right? Yeah. Do I get more? Yeah. Give, no, give him another couple. Okay. Give him another right. couple because I feel so bad. I've like ruined everything. Keep, keep yeah. going. Uh, I'm just going to, because I'm doing this for Children's News. Uh -huh. uh, and this, this latest movie feels more adult. Yes. Uh, it's more action and it's a bit more scary. Yes. Do you think that 10 year olds, can they go by themselves or should they go with their parents? I think, <clears throat> I think the movies are 12A. Um, so that should like give people an indication of, of what the age limit is, but it's certainly, 
I was scared and I I was in it and I made it. So if um, so certainly I don't think it's for I don't think it's for young children. I think it's like it's aimed at teenagers, definitely. Definitely. So you're looking at the the old movies, the first ones that you did? Do you used to to watch them now? Um yeah. Um I mean they kind of like come on TV every Christmas and uh so you can't really avoid them sometimes and but I don't really I don't really sit down and watch them unless they're kind of like just on television. But recently I've been thinking that I should watch some of the earlier ones. I think certainly before the last part comes out that I should watch all seven back to back and like kind of look at how I've changed and how the films have really changed and just like remind myself. Maybe the three of us should do it together. But um yeah, no I think I'll do that definitely.